Hello, Shadi, what is it? This Tony means you have been avoiding me. Wetley, I know you are upset, but can we talk? Talk, I'm listening. No, not on the phone. Let me come over. I just got back home. Okay, fine. Fine, it's alright. We can see you soon. Bye. That's nice. Mm. Wow. Thank you. <coughs> I'm sure you know I'm here because of Sasuke. You can't keep avoiding this conversation forever. I can't keep tolerating a temperamental fag just because of love. <laughs> Yet you know she would rather be guilty than live like a free bird. This thing I do smoking, I don't know, I'm talking to you and you are smoking. You know Sasuke loves you, and that's actually all that matters. You just need to talk about all these things. Shadi, mm -hmm. even though she's your friend, when you introduced her to me, I never told you I wanted a troubled heart. A troubled heart? Yes. You know, Sasuke is like a baby. Your own baby. All you need to do is treat her like a mother here. That's right. all that matters. It's only love that matters, bro. I have heard you. I am going to think about it. Think about it? Like, think about it or think about it? Which one? Shadi, like I say, I am going to think about it. You just have to give me some time to clear my head, okay? Thank you. Think about it. By the way, how are you? I'm fine, though. As you can see, I'm yeah. very, very fine. So, um, what do you want me to go for? I know sometimes I get emotional and say things out of anger. But work clear, baby. You know it can never change the way I feel about you. I'm always grateful for the day Shadi brought you to me. I'm sorry. Okay. You know you really hurt me with the venom of your temper. I didn't really expect you to be this reckless and callous, you know. I'm sorry. Oh. Oh. What's the problem? Are you okay? Just a slight bit of my Please stand, stand, stand. Okay. Oh. 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 So, Thank you. I, I don't really have any pinky line in this house. 
I have some in my bag. Oh, you do? Yes. Okay, good. Let me get you some water. Please. Oh. Sorry, sorry, baby. So, um, Sassy, how did you get the food? As you can see. tastes delicious, you know. <laughs> That's how we are blushing, you know. <laughs> oh my god. Sassy, sassy. What are you watching? Curiosity. I'm interested, please. Oh, wait. Were you expecting me to, to change the channel to is it Telemundo? What's your deal? You just in the world. Anything I did, said? Look at me. I'm trying to take things easy, okay? There are a lot we need to figure out before indulging our genitals in any erotic behavior. Like what? K, like what? Like genitals. Um, I am. I have sickle cell. And I don't want to get myself into any situation I will regret. Sickle? Sickle what? And you never mentioned it earlier. Why do I feel you are, you are such an opportunist? Isaski. Isaski. In the flesh and blood. Look, I did not take advantage. Did you feel okay? The conversation did not just go. And you keep leading me on? You must be very wicked. Self-centered, misleading and full of deceit. And all this meanness because I'm careful to have sex. <sighs> Wetle! Wetle!
Come on, Shadi. You never told me your friend is a sickler. Come on, Whitley. You know she's not a sickler. She's a lady. And if you are referring to her sickle cell, then you need to know that she's a warrior. That's how you refer to her. And that's supposed to make me feel better? See, it's up to you, you know. I know she didn't tell you about this earlier. I'm not going to make excuses for that. But you need to know that you fell in love with her personality and not her condition at the time. <sighs> Shadi. We have been friends for as long as only the calendar can remember. I least expect you're going to trick me into a relationship that I will never subscribe to. <sighs> All I've ever wanted was to fall in love and never end up with the burden of someone that would die at 25, 32 or whatever. Wetley, why are you talking like this? Is it because she doesn't have blood running through her veins? Or she doesn't have what other ladies have? See, it's like you're beginning to make more excuses than efforts to keep her. Frankly speaking, I don't see the need for this conversation. If you don't need her, then let her be. Sit down. You must have thought I would be the biggest idiot to allow you force yourself on me. Then you have not credited yourself well. You must be a crowned rechargeable idiot eh? whose cowardice is hinged on stupidity. You know what? So you, you are shouting on me, right? You are raising your voice. You fail to see how fraudulent you are. Even you are embarrassed to be a sickler. So you hid it from me. Mm. Yes. Beyond my sickle cell is ambition and prospect. You don't have to see it. Look, Wetley, I am sorry I didn't tell you before, but it was never out of any malicious intent. I know the battles I have fought to get here. I know the crisis I have had and I will never forget. I am a warrior. I didn't bargain for this. You claim to be a lady, but all I see is someone that is about to die. Yes. I don't want anyone's blood to be on my hands. That's if your blood has not contaminated mine. Aren't you sick? <laughs> Look, I am not talking malaria or typhoid or hepatitis. I know everybody is battling something, but are you not dying? At least I am dying. But you, Wetley, you are a dead man. All I see is a man whose liver is rotten with cirrhosis. Who knows? You may go to bed and journey to your miserable afterlife. Look, if your perception about people is based on what they are battling, <laughs> then you must be archaic, barbaric, uncivilized, uncultured, and a waste of an architect. Excuse me.
Kay. I am sorry, Kay. I was just overwhelmed. <sighs> Fine, you are right. Everyone is sick. It's just a matter of time. I know how much you love me. And I love you too. But you just have to. You just have to allow me. Let me come into this battle so that we can conquer it all together. Wait, 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 wait. Come and sit, please. What is it again? I need to see your test results. It's not okay that you say you are AA. Let's know how far the journey ahead is, please. Okay, fine. I'm very sure. Yeah, yeah I'm good. Thank you. <sighs> Now, do you want me to massage you? Is it your hand? Did you try to take? Sorry, 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 okay. Uh, let me take you to the hospital. Uh, let me just let me just the pharmacy, it's closer. Pharmacy, are you sure about that? It's closed. Oh, no, right. fine, fine, it's okay. <laughs> Baby, I'm sorry, okay. I'm sorry. Jeff. Get the jacket. <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. I'm not your customer. Go and get the pharmacies. <laughs> okay. How are you feeling? I am not fine. I am not fine. My hands and my back hurt. What medication do you take? I took painkillers. I use water and balm. The drugs are not working again. I want injection. I'm sorry, I, I can't administer any injection without prescription. I told you that the last time. But why? They can be addicted and they put all sorts of tricks on their sleeves to get injected. Just to enjoy the film. But I've been with her all day. And she has been in a lot of pain. She's, she took some drugs earlier today. I'm sorry, there's nothing I can do. Can I give you Diclo? You have no idea the pain I am enduring. And I react to Diclo. Then call your doctor. Okay. Let's forget this guy. I will take you to the hospital, okay? Let's go. Careful. <laughs> 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 